Here's why the NBA playoffs are rigged. Hey guys, welcome back to NBA Orb. Today we'll talk about here is why the NBA playoffs are rigged. Let's head into it. Number 8. The questionable calls of the 2006 NBA Finals. The 2006 Finals have oftentimes been called out as an example that the NBA fixes games and series to get the results that it knows will generate the most revenue. The theory here is that the league realized that at a young rising superstar in Wade, and they saw an opportunity to elevate Wade even more through his final series. In the final four games of the series, Wade shot an average of 18 free throws per game. The Heat would win the final four games of the series, but the three throw attempts between the two teams were enormously in favor of the Heat. Late in the series clinching game six, Wade drove to the basket, elbowing Dirk Nowitzki in the face on his way to the basket. The officials awarded Wade free throws instead of an offensive foul, and the Heat went on to win their fourth straight game to win the title. Number 7. Cleveland Cavaliers get first pick in 2011 the Cleveland Cavaliers were a mess, and it was all due to their best player in the franchise history leaving their team for Miami in the summer of 2010. The Cavaliers were a little lucky to have two chances at hitting the lottery, but the first round pick that they had just acquired from the Clippers had just a 2.8% chance of converting them into the number one pick after the Clippers finished with the eighth worst record in basketball. The prevailing theory here is that NBA saw a fan base that was turned off from basketball after LeBron's decision. To reinvigorate the fans, the NBA knew that Cleveland had to have success on NBA draft after lottery night, and it all started when the Cavs heard that they had gotten the fourth pick with their own selection. Then the Clippers pick became the first pick in the draft against all odds, and the NBA had again made basketball relevant in the state of Ohio. Number 6. Chris Ball trade to the Lakers next there was once a time when NBA fans were all convinced that Chris Paul was heading to Los Angeles Lakers. It had become obvious that Paul's patience had run thin in New Orleans, and he was ready to join a team that was in a large market. At the time, the league had owned the New Orleans Hornets. Hornets general manager Del Demps had a deal in place which involved Paul to the Lakers, Paul Gasol to the Houston Rockets, and Lamar Odom, Kevin Martin, Goran Dragic, and Luis Sicola in a first-round draft pick from Houston via New York to the Hornets. David Stern stepped in and vetoed the trade, and the main reason the deal was off so was that the league could keep a more competitive balance. To promote parity, the league allowed Paul to be traded to the Los Angeles Clippers instead. Number 5. New Orleans gets the number 1 pick the New Orleans Hornets had just lost a superstar in Chris Paul, and the league knew that it had interfered with the transaction and had made it up to the Hornets in some way or fashion. The way it was, the NBA draft lottery. The Charlotte Bobcats had just a season where they had the worst winning percentage of any team in NBA history, and it would seem that they would at least earn the first pick and get Anthony Davis as their franchise savior. Instead, the New Orleans Hornets moved up four spots in the lottery and got number one pick. The Hornets had a 13% chance of getting at the top pick, and it wasn't a shock to conspiracy theorists that they landed the pick because it it seemed like the league was making up for vetoing the first Chris Paul this season trade earlier. Number 4. Cleveland Cavaliers get the first pick again In 2014, the Milwaukee Bucks had the league's worst record and the Philadelphia 76ers were in the first year of their drastic tanking strategy that was employed by Sam Hinky. Surely it would be hard for any team to move past these two struggling franchises, but the league saw an opportunity to again cause controversy. The Cleveland Cavaliers won the draft lottery once again for the third time in five years. It seemed a bit too perfect for Cleveland, and the theory is that NBA seemed to be playing favorites with the city of Cleveland due to the city's long history of losing in sports, and 2014 presented one of the best draft classes coming out in recent memory. The Cavaliers got LeBron James back over the summer as well, when they used their draft pick Andrew Wiggins as ammunition to acquire all-star Kevin Love from the Timberwolves, and the Cavs were now a championship contender. Number 3. 2016 Western Conference Finals Conspiracy theories have always been prevalent in the playoffs of the four major sports leagues in the U.S. fan. Sometimes I felt that a league will extend a series so that they can generate more revenue, done by fixing games potentially. The NBA social media page stirred up some controversy when it revealed on its events page the events taking place May 30th through June 5th. They had an event for Game 7 of the Western Conference Finals between the Golden State Warriors and Oklahoma City Thunder, but they also had an event for Game 1 of the NBA Finals. The event for the Golden State Warriors and the Cleveland Cavaliers, but the Golden State Warriors had not yet even won the Western Conference. This led to people thinking the league fixed the Western Conference Finals and helped the 73-win Warriors reach it so that they could get more viewers from the NBA Finals. Number 2. Mutombo congratulates Sixers on first pick Dikembe Mutombo is a legendary NBA basketball player who made a legendary mistake hours before the NBA lottery was televised. To be fair, the actual lottery happens in a back room hours before it is televised, but still Mutombo's actions brought many fans to the conclusion that the lottery was rigged. Mutombo set out a tweet congratulating the Philadelphia 76ers on getting the first pick in the draft hours before the lottery was going to be televised. The 76ers had the best chance at getting the first pick after finishing the, with the worst record in the NBA in 2015-2016, but it was still strange that Mutombo sent out a tweet and then a 
apologize for the premature congratulations by retracting his statement. When the 76ers got the first pick in the draft later that night, no one was surprised. Number 1. Draymond Green Suspended The poster boy of the NBA is LeBron James, and things were not looking up for James and the Cavaliers in the 2016 NBA Finals. Draymond Green was a flagrant foul away from being suspended for a game after kicking his opponents in the Western Conference Finals. The Cavs were heading towards going down three games to one in the best of seven NBA Finals, and he had a tall task ahead of him to bring his team back. In Game 4, James baited Draymond Green into a flagrant foul by pushing him down to the floor and stepping over him. The league suspended Green for his retaliation, but his retaliation wasn't nearly as bad as the aggressor LeBron James's actions in this incident. If Green isn't suspended, perhaps the Warrior go on to win Game 5 in the championship instead of a blowing a 3-1 to one lead. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss any of our videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are on your screen because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.